What's going on everyone? It's your boy Dome Checker back with another video. I'm signing on today with something fantastic. You guys are gonna love it. You guys ever just wanted to travel with all of your gear, like your screens, your computer, your keyboard, and just didn't have the space to do it? Well, I do. And I just found out about it recently, and I went ahead and made the purchase. Oh, yeah. That is a great big bag. Sure do say so myself. Today, we're gonna go into a first look of what this bag is, what it does, what it can hold, see if it can hold my setup and everything that I am gonna use the game when I travel. But let's go ahead and take a closer look, guys. I'll see you in a second. All right, guys. So like I said, we're going to take a first look at this huge, huge bag. Raising it up, you can see it is the size of my torso. It's the size of my upper body. So when I put this thing on, it's going to be sticking out. It's going to look crazy. So the specs, the load bearing for this backpack is 70 pounds. So you can put 70 pounds worth of equipment in here and it'd be okay. Your weight when empty. So this bag by itself weighs 6.15 pounds. Primary material this is made out of is 900 PU nylon. And the zippers are ZBS seamless zippers there's a lot of buckles my favorite thing a lot of molly webbing if i want to i could take some of my pouches that i have from the army i could buy more pouches black pouches it doesn't matter i could buy pouches and put them on this thing on the back you have your straps you have a chest buckle you have a waist buckle so you can put it around your waist continue to the sides you have these big openings where you can tighten or loosen the sides also has a buckle on this side same thing on the bottom you have more straps where you can loosen or tighten it depending on how much stuff you got in there and on the top there's another strap unbuckle it to get into all your stuff and this one depending on how much how tall it is you can pull it tight that way it's all smushed together and doesn't move around too much the first pouch we're going to open is the big bottom pouch there's a strap kind of in the way we're not going to worry about that it's got your pouches for pens pencils notepads anything you need the top pouch longer than it is tall as you can see you put several mice you put multiple things in there that don't weigh too much that aren't too big but it's got plenty of room for your smaller things like camera lenses and such is another big pouch it has mesh webbing that way you can put things in it, it doesn't fly around for me i'd probably put like my hd60s you know my microphone and stuff like that in these pouches so they don't slosh everywhere and get tangled up is this what it looks like on the inside nothing on the front though so no other pouches just on the actual bag itself and then we get to the big big one the money maker right here the big pouch it opens all the way up all right so it's nice and felty on the front side protect your stuff won't scratch it up you have this small protective case it's got very very thin foam you can see probably you know half an inch thick at the most but you can see this is where you'd put your desktop the main pouch of this has a strap to keep your computer safe strapped in nice and tight ain't going anywhere back of it also has this nice felty material that way it protects your computer or whatever you have in here not going to scratch it we got silica gel guys overall so far so good guys there's one more zipper below the strap i don't know what you'd put back here personally i wouldn't put anything because that's your protective to protect your back but I guess you could put like a bag, you know, like a, a shirt or something in it, you know, a rag, something you're going to carry that's not going to be bulging because it's going to be in your back. Overall, this bag's fantastic. I might buy, you know, a protective hard case, you know, this big just to, you know, protect my stuff a little bit more. But other than that, guys, fantastically made. So the next thing we're going to do, we're going to take all of my equipment. As you can see, I'm a little naked back here. I already took everything down. I'm going to put it up on the table so you can guys take a quick look at it. And then I'm going to stuff it into this bag, see what we can fit see how much we can fit and hopefully all of our gear fits hopefully i don't know about the 27 inch screen we might have to downgrade to the 24 just to see all right guys so first things first we are going to put the big computer and the big protective case into the big bag so as you can see i have my corsair iq desktop a pretty heavy desktop right now it's only got a 1080 inside of it got to be nice and careful with it i don't want to accidentally break it just to test it out you know oh this fits this fits perfectly this couldn't have been any better as you can see on this side we have a rubber strap i don't know what this is meant for but it is here so let's go ahead and put this big bad boy into the big bag so guys i know you don't see it here in this video but i did try to squeeze that 27 inch monitor in there however it did not work so i had to downgrade to the 24 inch and the 24 inch actually fit perfectly it zipped right up it wasn't moving around and it was perfect let's make sure it's off the table completely give it some time to get it and we are at 50.6 pounds like said by the specs we can carry 70 pounds in this bad boy so since we're not overweight let's go ahead and throw this bad boy on our back oh man 
It's actually a lot more comfortable than it looks. It's kind of big on the back, as you can see. Let me tighten this belly strap here. This thing is massive, and it doesn't feel like it's too heavy. Everything's on my back. It's nice and secure. If I wanted to, honestly, I could probably go on a run with it, but I'm not going to do that. Not with my computer. If I wanted to carry it somewhere, this is easy. Too easy. Too easy. Tell me what you think in the comments below. I think this bag is fantastic buy. It's a little on the expensive side, $199 right now. If you want to, take a look at it on their website. I'll post that link in the description below. But as always, I'm Dome Checker. I stream Monday, Wednesday, Fridays on Twitch. You can find me on every social media platform at Dome Checker TTV. If I'm not on Twitch, hit me up on social media. I can hit you back. Dome Checker, signing off. Can you tell me why? Can you tell me why? I'm down, yeah. No friends of mine, no friends of mine around, yeah. Now I'm thinking, I, now I'm thinking, I might have caught the June blues, yeah. I wanna try myself inside the juice, yeah. You know, I keep on running from the truth. Is that not? I'm just a